bring a fight here. Where that's about to right, I'm going to tell you the truth about San Francisco, right? We looked at various different cities. One of the reasons the fight took a long time to get announced was the lack of availability of venues. So obviously Vegas is a, a, a venue you look at. We looked at Atlanta, we looked at Washington, we looked at New York, we looked at Houston. Houston, And Devin had wanted to come back for the Bay Area for a long time. But there's no, like, one of the problems you guys have got with new cities for boxing, and I know there's been boxing here before, but there hasn't been a world championship fight in San Francisco for over a decade, right? Mm -hmm. So it's like, but how do you draw, especially for a British promoter and a, a British company, I know we're here, but what is the analysis that tells you that San Francisco will work? Right, okay, you know you've got one of the best venues in the world, you know you've got the Warriors, you know you've got that support system, you know you've got a great sports city, you know you've got Devin down the road, but still, what would make you so sure that it worked here over Atlanta or Washington or, you know? So we did a little bit of that, you know, yeah. and, and said, let's go, let's do it. And we're at today, we're nearly at 9,000 in the first week of sale. I think it's unbelievable because don't, don't forget, we do a show, two shows a month in America. I know how tickets sell. And outside of the big stuff, you know, to do that number, we've got seven weeks to go. So the lower bowl is nearly taken care of. We'll go into the upper bowl. I would be surprised if we didn't sell it out. At least do 14, 15,000. I think that's amazing. And like, I'd like to take some of the, cr the credit. But I just said <laughs> to How much was Haney pushing for you, Ed? He was like, a fight here or was he was, he was fine with all of it. But I said to him, once he found out about San Francisco, I'm not just saying this, he was like, wow, that'd be so cool to go back there. And I was like, I actually said to Devin, do you think it works? Because I'm at this point, I'm just looking for a little bit of reinforcement. Just tell me it's okay. Do you know what I mean? And he went, I think it'll do really well there, but everybody says that. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So like, I didn't know at this point whether we'd be sitting here at 3,000 or 9,000. So I'm absolutely over the moon. And, and these guys have done a brilliant job and they're invested in trying to make it work. The Chase Center and, and the Warriors and everybody. Anybody Anybody Floyd Mayweather said, Floyd Mayweather said uh, he area? would like to match his prodigy, Carmel Kerm Moten, against your fighter, Lee Wood. <laughs> kind of like Loma did. Yeah. What's your thought of, what's your thought well, of? that Milton's definitely not Lomachenko, um, but he's obviously got some talent. But Lee Wood's moving to Super Feather now. Uh, maybe even rematch Josh Warrington. Maybe fight Joe Caldina. But uh, maybe Milton one day. Hey, Eddie, How did like, hey, Eddie. potentially putting on a pay per view on the same day? Uh, what, with Floyd? Yeah. yeah, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I think that, listen, all these platforms, you saw on Saturday on the Misfits card, which was interesting, I was there. That was on ESPN. Right? A lot of these platforms now will just be looking to take pay-per-views because it's a way, if the deal's right, to make money. So I think that you're going to see a lot of pay-per-views. You know, don't rule out seeing this fight on ESPN as well. Don't rule out seeing this fight on another platform as well because that's the key for the, the pay-per-view sort of, I guess, uh, investor, if you like, the principal broadcaster for the show to make sure that it does as many buys as possible. And if you can broaden that reach... I think you'll see more of that now. I'm not worried about Floyd Mayweather doing a pay-per-view on, you know, December 16th, but a uh, 9th, but you know, who knows? Hey, did you make a date right there? Technical fight that you would say, Devin, because I'm big on 